flowers for my wife for our 44th anniversary. I want to be able to do everything that my friends do on their smartphones without any help. As that clip shows, the digital revolution has left one key demographic behind. In the age of swiping and tapping, how can the disabled use smartphone technology? Well, enter Sesame Enable, the world's first smartphone touch-free smartphone, and it's already gotten the attention of Google and Verizon, among others. Sesame Enable CEO and co-founder Oded Ben Dove joins us now. Welcome, Oded. So great to have you here. Thank you, Tanya. It's a pleasure. Tell us the story behind Sesame Enable. I understand it was started with the help of a quadriplegic, correct? That's true. Uh, my co-founder, Giora Livne, is a quadriplegic. I went on TV in Israel uh, demonstrating a game that was controlled using head gestures. And I get a phone call the very next day, uh, the guy on the line says, Hi, my name is Gior, I can't move my hands or legs. Could you make me a smartphone I could use? And I knew right then and then th that was a calling. That, that was it. Yeah. So tell us how the technology works exactly. Is it voice activated? Does it follow the eyes of the user? That's right. So we take the best of all worlds, sort of speak. Um, we utilize the front-facing camera to track the user's face, and he gets control through, of, over the entire smartphone or tablet. Uh, just using his face, he turns on the phone by saying, open sesame. Fabulous. That turns it on. That's great. And so the face movements are what will then control the cursor on the, on the f face of the phone? That's exactly it. We have a cursor on screen, and it works with any app. It's not just a dialer, not just a text message. You can, we, we've had children play Angry Birds for the oh, first time in their lives. So. That's fantastic. Is it just for Android right now? It's just for Android, as it's a very open operating system that we can interact with. Any chance that you could move into iPhone? Have you been talking to Apple about it? Uh, I hope the Apple folks are uh, watching this. Right. <laughs> Hopefully they are. Yeah. So tell us, who is Sesame Enable for? Uh, Sesame was designed by and for people with disabilities with limited or no use of their hands. Uh, anyone who can't operate a touch screen sufficiently. Our slogan is, touch is overrated, which is, of course, a pun, but um, it's really, like you said, it overlooked an entire audience. Yes. So how many disabled people do you now have using Sesame Enable? So right now, we launched a project with Google in Israel uh, to serve the technology to anyone who needs it for free. Congratulations, by the Thank way. They donated so a million dollars towards that's right. that. They that's fantastic. That's right. And thanks to Google and Betty Z. Shapira, who are involved. And so right now we have 300 users. We're marked to reach 3,000 in Israel. Fantastic. And we're getting orders from all over the world. So. And you've gotten so many recognition, so much recognition and so many awards lately from South by Southwest, from former mayor of New York, Bloomberg here, right. Verizon, also gave you a million dollar prize. That's true. Very exciting. Is there anyone I've left off of that list? Um, that's all. Uh, oh, the state of Texas. And yeah, it's subsidized by the state of Texas. If you get one in Texas, the government will pay you back for most of it. Very, very exciting. Thank so, you. what are your goals for this company? Uh, so we um, we co we sorry we are uh, looking towards 2016 to get the phone to anyone who needs it in the United States. Uh, this is our year year really to push forward. Mm -hmm. uh, and looking even uh, to the future, we hope this company serves as an example that you can make an honest living and change thousands and hundreds of thousands of lives. And speaking of changing lives, give us an example of some of the reactions you've had from children who play Angry Birds for the first time. Yeah, well, my reaction is usually crying. Yeah. <laughs> um, but we've had children play Angry Birds. We've had our number one user from Texas says he's been waiting for this technology for 15 years. Mm. Another user said he hasn't had a private phone call in 10 years because there's always someone holding the phone dialing. And it's so profound, you know, he's a 30-year-old man, he needs his privacy. He needs that autonomy. It's so interesting. So many of us just live with our smartphone. It's like an appendage. We don't even think about it anymore. But to have to rely on someone to do that for us would be so frustrating. That's it. And yeah. you're helping people do this on their own, which is fantastic. Yeah, we're giving independence, privacy, self-esteem. Mm -hmm. And as a developer, you created this technology. What was the biggest challenge for you? So I think the biggest challenge was adapting to all sorts of special needs. We discovered that within special needs, everyone has special needs of his own. Um, so there are different conditions. There's spinal cord injury, cerebral palsy, multiple cirrhosis. Um, each condition sometimes requires some minute uh, changes, customizations. Mm -hmm. um, and we got more and more users along the way to make sure we're 
offering it and making it available to as so wide it's enough. So it's not one size fits all. There's some personalization required for each user. Uh, that's right, but it, mm -hmm. it works out, out of the bat just uh, most of the times. But then if you do want to, you can adjust the sensitivity and other parameters. And you have one on your on your lap there. Can you that's open right. it up and show us? Yeah, of course. So um, it searches for my face or any face uh, it sees. And this is just using the front-facing camera. And I have this cursor on screen. Wow. Following my head movements. And, and uh, to make an action, I stay in place. And now I can... Oh, Incredible. Thank you so much. And you type by bringing up a keyboard and using the cursor? Yeah, you can type by exactly using a keyboard or you can use the dictation capabilities available in Android smartphones. And you can make phone calls that way? and Phone calls, text messages, Facebook, YouTube, games like we mentioned, anything. Fantastic. Oh, did ma magnificent technology. Congratulations you so to you and we wish you continued success. Thank you so much.